Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I learned a little bit tonight. I've never used templates. And somebody emailed me and asked me a question about templates, and he said it's not saving your settings, and maybe he's not saving it correctly. I don't know. But if you looked, I've changed my nudge distance to a quarter of an inch. I've changed my duplicate offset to five, a half an inch. I've changed my color to black hairline, and that's not my default. So we're going to save this. Matter of fact, we're going to save a new one. We're going to control D and make a duplicate, and you see your offset. And let's say you want to save that as a template. You go to File, Save As, and we're going to go Test 3. But right here, you need to go down and save it as a Corel template, and then hit, hit Save. It's going to ask you some questions. I guess you could choose a category and put it you know, in different categories that might help you find it later. So we're gonna close this down, and we're gonna open a regular Corel file. We're gonna open, uh, this right here is a butterfly. And as you can see, I've got my uh, nudge distance at 0 .005, my duplicate distance back to zero, and my colors to red, which is my default. But let's go and open up that template. And it is test three. And as soon as I open it up, there's my, I can act new from template or open for editing. Oh, I've got to play around with that. So here's my template, but my offset, my nudge distance is a quarter inch, my offset is 0 0.05, and my hairline is black. So anytime I draw in this program, I'm gonna get a black hairline. I still don't see the advantage to making a template, but maybe in the future I'll figure it out. Uh, he just wanted to be able to open it up on two computers and it'd be the same. To me, as long as your bed size is the same, a Corel file should, should open up the same. Now, your defaults are gonna be different. So if you save it as a template, it should open with these defaults. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.